And that is our big story this evening. Charges now filed against a Milwaukee man for leading authorities on a police chase that ended in a multi-vehicle crash. The suspect's leg was trapped in his own vehicle and the fire department, they had to cut him out. Fox 6 is Angelica Sanchez. She's live and she has video showing the suspect dodging in and out of traffic just before the crash. Angie? Yeah, it's really unbelievable, guys. In fact, this police chase only lasted about 45 seconds. It began here at the parking lot of Macy's here in Mayfair and Wauwatosa. The suspect was originally wanted for an expired vehicle registration. It turns out he was already a wanted man. The average car is not built for excessive speeds. We'll see some vehicle parts and some damage over there from that crash. Which is why it only takes seconds for a driver to lose control. Clearly had no regard for anybody's safety, including his own. Charges are now filed against 33-year-old Demetrius Meeks. He's accused of second degree recklessly endangering safety as well as fleeing and eluding an officer. Authorities say a police chase began last Friday near Mayfair Mall. An officer noticed the suspect's vehicle registration expired. I'm attempting to stop a vehicle in the Macy's North Park. But the suspect takes off. Going northbound in the parking lot, it's going to be a white Chevy Malibu. Watch as the suspect vehicle zigzags away from police. Prosecutors say speeds were well over 87 miles per hour. Police decided to call off the chase just as the suspect collides with two other vehicles, which brings us to this. Stay in the car! Stay in the car! The suspect's life was trapped in his own vehicle. Got a gun on you? No! Why would I have a gun on you? Because you're running from the police. The fire department needed to cut him out of his car. Don't move! My leg! Captain Brian Zalewski says the suspect is still recovering from his injuries. The chase lasted about 45 seconds. He says it's a reminder of the many dangers on the road. And it's unfortunate that these suspects make these decisions to flee from police and put everybody else in danger. And the suspect has an open felony warrant out of Kenosha County. He was the only person injured in this police chase. Live in Wauwatosa tonight, Angelica Sanchez, Fox 6 News. Yeah, these chases put everyone in danger, including themselves. Angelica, thank you.